Yo, what is going on YouTube? What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. How are you guys doing out there today, man? So today we're here with a first time reaction to Roy Buchanan. Okay, I haven't ever heard of this gentleman before and it looks like we have the heat of battle right here. Um, so this is a donation request via buy me a coffee. So thank you so much for the support. Really appreciate that. Let's go ahead and read this through. We're going to have two reactions actually on this one and I'll go ahead and see if he's got the information listed here. Um, it says, Sean, you're the best reactor on YouTube. You've listened to SRV, Jeff Healy, Gary Moore, and many of the greats, but you need to listen to who they thought was the greatest. Just watch this clip and give it a try. So that's uh, one of them. I think that's going to be the live performance that we're going to check out. There's another one here. The other donation request reads, Sean, your hard work and views on life and family are the reasons you make people smile. In the sometimes dark times, you show your fans there is goodness in people. It's greatly appreciated. Here's another full out banger from Roy Buchanan that I think you'll like since you are uh, you were a metal guy. It's a banger. All right, so we're going to check out both of them. We've got the Heat of Battle. We'll do this one first, and then we'll jump straight into the other request um, for Mr. Roy Buchanan. All right, thank you so much for the support. Really appreciate that. Hope you're doing well today. Um, I know we discussed a little bit some of the things uh, that you're going through. I'm so sorry for that, and I hope you can um, fight back on that one. Fight back on that one. So let's go ahead and jump into this, guys. I'm going to uh, take it back right here. And we're going to start from the beginning. Here we go. Thank you so much for tuning in today. Let's go ahead and check check out uh, Roy Buchanan. Okay, here we go. Nice drumming.
Allman Brothers right there. With some Dickie Betts. Just a straight instrumental flex right here by Roy Buchanan and whoever he has backing him here. Uh, the drum beat was definitely the first thing kind of sparking the interest. They explode off into guitar. It almost sounded at points dueling um, guitars, but at least I'm assuming Roy Buchanan on one of those things leading it all the way through the track. Um, you got different. You got the shredding. You've got the slow playing. You got almost the, the I don't even know. What that is, man, the closest thing I can relate it to now is like Southern classic rock is where it's giving me there was a section that just gave me that Dwayne Allman, a uh, Dickie Betts kind of feeling, man, that you feel with some of their music uh, just gave me that kind of, you know, out in the fields, man, just really good vibes. So he hit you with different almost styles. It felt like on this solo. So that was our first introduction to Roy Buchanan. Let's go ahead and jump into the next one and see what we're getting with that one. I believe it's a live performance. All right, right here, moving on along, we got Roy Buchanan. When a guitar plays the blues, um, at, this is at Carnage, Carnegie Hall, maybe New York City. Okay, so maybe that's the name of the song, When a Guitar Plays the Blues. I wasn't linked the name of these songs, um, so the best I got is what the videos say right here. So let's go ahead and jump into this one, check out this live performance now, and see what happens, okay? <laughs> Thank you. 
get the strangest kind of feeling. That thing was screaming the blues. Yeah, when the guitar plays the blues. You know, you get the strangest little feeling. Yeah, when the guitar plays the blues. You know your body gets a message You and your soul is a god of groove You know you might even bat your eye Yeah, you might even sense a cry You know that feeling you're feeling in you Well, you know you just can't hide Kind of been like this. You kind of squeak like that. You get the strangest kind of feeling. Yeah, when the guitar plays. Music's over. It's time to turn out the lights. You know the blues gonna go home with you. Yeah, and it soothes you through the night. You get the strangest kind of feeling. Yeah, when the guitar plays. You know your body's gonna get the message. Yeah, that's gonna put you right back in that groove.
that very last section there where he told um the drummer kind of hey hold on played that was that a classical piece um i want to say i heard that before um i don't know the names of very many classical compositions um and it almost wants to come to mind like maybe something about bees um so i don't know maybe that's what that was overall this one um really man that sound they they have this like peaking that sound was peaking out my ears are kind of ringing right now uh so um really crazy yeah really high intense performance by by his guitar playing there was some part where it looked like he was picking and pulling on the strings with his fingers i love seeing stuff like that uh to me it's just like next level guitar play very difficult it seems to do so uh, you got the shreds you got the slow plays you got the gu guitar crying on this one so roy was really hitting you with a lot of different blues styles i would say and it sounds like the lyrical message on this is just hey you get this strange feeling when you hear the blues right because the blues are about being down and out and kind of this sadness this blue feeling uh, but it makes you feel so good when that groove kind of hits your soul it hits your body uh so you it's a conflicting kind of interest to feel good with the music sad with the lyrics what do i do right you get this strange kind of feeling when that guitar plays the blues for you all right learning a little bit about this one this was about the album only they don't have the song specifically that i can click on but it looks like it's the first track off this album that was released in 1985 from mr roy buchanan okay uh the album's mainly rock blues um and you got different producers on this roy buchanan uh dick Sher sherman and bruce iglar Okay, Iglaru, maybe? I don't know. So uh, they got different instrumentations throughout this whole album, um, but it looks like up there on stage we only had bass and drums, so I don't know if that is actually the Larry Exum and Morris Jennings who were present on this album up there helping him um, because I assume that was, yeah, sometime after this album came out. Let's learn a little bit about Roy right here. Mr. Roy Buchanan uh, out of Ozark, Arkansas. Okay, born in 1939. Uh, he's actually passed away by now he died in 1988 is that right dude that video looks older than this time frame did we say they do not list when that performance was that we just checked out but uh it says he passed away in 1988 at the age of 48 um wow wow you guys let me know man that sounds like i mean that's the information there like i said that performance looked like it would have been after 1988 to me but no it seems like that's it so rest in peace mr roy buchanan man uh genres are blues blues rock electric blues rock and roll rockabilly country jazz uh his occupations are musician songwriter instruments or guitar and vocals of course man so rest in peace it looks like he is buried out in uh, arlington virginia okay in the united states so uh that's what we got with this one thank you for introducing me right here um I believe the gentleman uh, who requested this was saying that there are quite a few people who were inspired. If you know of any big artists that I might know who have directly uh, brought out Mr. Roy Buchanan and his uh, contributions to their styles, man, I would very be very much be interested in hearing a little bit about that if y'all have got any of that information. Okay, so thank you guys for tuning in today. I hope you enjoyed tuning in and rocking with me here today, man. If you did, please consider becoming a member here on my YouTube and Patreon for as little as three bucks. Thank you so much for the donation request, man. Don't forget to like subscribe check out the descriptions for more information on how you can help the channel and i'll see y'all guys on the next one all right peace